I'll be showing you how to enable and use voice typing on your Samsung Galaxy S24. Now I'm using the S24 Ultra for this tutorial, but this works on all the Galaxy S24s. So let's say you're using your keyboard and you want to use your voice to type instead of uh, typing like this with your fingers, you want to use your voice, okay? So you have to enable that in the settings. Now, you can either tap on the settings icon right here on the keyboard. That should take you to your Samsung keyboard settings. Of course, assuming you're using Samsung keyboard as the default keyboard on your phone. And then under Samsung keyboard settings, if you scroll down, you should see voice input. You want to tap on that. And then if it's set to none, it means it's disabled. And so you can choose to enable either using the Samsung uh, voice input which uses Samsung's knowledge base or you can use Google's voice typing. Now I prefer Google's because I think Google is much more broad in terms of the knowledge base. So I'll select uh, Google voice typing and then go back to my keyboard and now I should see a little microphone icon in the bottom left corner of the screen. Okay so now I can use that to type Good morning. I am using voice typing. And then you can hit that back arrow when you're done using the voice input. Now, you might have noticed that there are no punctuations on this uh, 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 voice input. So you might have to add punctuations yourself or you can go ahead and customize. Now, the best way to customize if you want to use Google is probably just using the Google keyboard and then customizing the voice input inside Google keyboard. But if you use the Samsung engine, you can always go back to the Samsung keyboard settings, go back to voice input, and then select Samsung voice input. And that allows you to uh, customize a few things. And you might even get some punctuation on automatically. Okay, so let's try the Samsung uh, voice input. Good morning. I am using Samsung voice input. Period. Full stop. Well, it's it's not too bad. It's uh, more or less the same, but this at least added a comma and that's so you can play around with both of them and find out what works best for you. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.